you, I'm in the rock. I did it myself. Hey guys, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Michaela, and you should definitely subscribe. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and hop straight into what today's video is because this one was long awaited for me. Like, I was excited to film this. There is one thing that I don't have yet, um, but we'll get to that when we get to that. But today's video is going to be buying my dream fall wardrobe. It's pretty much, in other words, it's a fall clothing haul, but with a more catchier title. So, I have some items from Depop, some items from Shein, Ross, and some items that were thrifted. So, I'm going to get into everything with you guys and show you guys what my pickups have been for the fall season so we'll go ahead and hop straight into the video because i know y'all probably is i know y'all want to see what i got so the first place we're going to get into is where i have the most stuff from but before we get into that i'm going to show you guys what i got from tj maxx did i mention this was going to be a try on haul this is going to be a try on haul so the first thing i got from well the only thing that i got from tj maxx was this brown crop tee it is like a really pretty tan brown color it's cropped which is good because i wear a lot of high-waisted jeans anyways and i don't really mind it being cropped i got this in a size large anything from tj maxx or ross i typically get in a large if it's a shirt like this because i have a very long torso so things tend to be like really cropped or like really tight around my chest like that and i don't really like that i will be including sizes and prices in this haul this shirt was only 6.99 and i do like the material it's a very soft material and very stretchy um, I like this kind of material in shirts. I prefer this over that weird cotton. So as you can see, it's like really stretchy material. So now moving on to everything else that I got from Ross. First thing I have from Ross is this crew neck right here and it just says Montana on it. It's like a yellow tan color and then on the arm, it says Montana down the arm too. I wasn't really drawn to it for what it says, but this really gave me like Shein crew neck kind of vibe because Shein crew necks have the state. And as you'll see, this fits me really nicely. I got this in a size medium and it was $13.99. Um, that's around the same price that the Shein crew necks typically go for. So that's why I was like, I'll go ahead and do it. I will say this is a very thin material. It's almost kind of see-through. So it's definitely not gonna keep you warm. But for the earlier months, it'll be really cute. Or if you even wanna wear like a coat and some Uggs in the winter time, that would be nice too. So I got this crew neck right here. So the next thing I got from Ross is super cute green long sleeve and it's had it's not just a regular long sleeve you know it has some detailing on the front right here it has like i guess you could call it like it's like ruched a little bit but it has like the string so you can make it cropped or not and it has two of those in the front this also definitely gave me sheen vibes i noticed a lot of the stuff that ross sells now is stuff that Shein would sell which Shein copies everybody so it's really not surprising but as you see this fits really really nicely and really cute I got this in a size medium and this was $7.99 I really like the color I'm really liking brown and like green now for some reason so I got this green shirt and I feel like it'll be really cute with some Uggs for the fall or winter time the next thing I got from Ross is actually a hoodie and I got this at the beginning of summer I believe but it is just this champion hoodie and I know y'all probably thinking like girl champion we do not wear champion but y'all this was only $25 it was $24.99 I got it in a men's small but I got it because I wear like leggings and stuff in the winter and fall time and this is that perfect boyfriend kind of fit um it just has like the black hood and it this is so cute I'm not gonna lie they had a black one and I was like I have enough black hoodies let me get a gray one but I figured this would be super cute with like a pair of leggings and just Y'all know. The next thing I got was kind of a little bit out of my comfort zone. Um, I actually got some leather pants. Um, I know. I was actually looking on Shein and I put a bunch of stuff in my cart. And then I was like, let me go to Ross real quick to see if they have anything that um, resembles what I wanted to get. And they had these. So I did get these and I tried them on and they actually fit really nicely. Because if you know me, I'm 5'8", so I'm really tall. Uh, that's another thing. A lot, Every pair of pants that I got fits the long legs. So these right here were $10.99 and I got these in a size medium the only thing i don't like about them i don't know if you can see the inside but this material is like i'm not i don't know how to explain the material but these keep you so hot like you cannot wear these in the summertime um but they just have like a little design down the front and then the back is just plain but i feel like these would be really cute i was thinking about wearing these to my concert but it's gonna be really hot so i'm not gonna do that but i would definitely put a cute outfit together with these and these are more of 
solely for Instagram pictures, not for everyday wear or just wearing them out because you will be sweating and they sound, you hear it, they sound really plasticky and they feel really plasticky. So these will be like pretty much only for Instagram pictures, but I did get these. And the last thing that I got from Ross, I actually already wore these, but these are just some more of like the plaid pants. These are a size small, medium, and I think these were 10. Um, but they go all the way down. I have another pair which are from Fashion Nova that I got from Plato's Closet. But I got another pair because I like wearing these kind of pants to work. I feel like they make me look very classy with like a black shirt tucked into them. So I did get a pair of these pants. So that is everything that I got from Ross. Now we're going to move on to the stuff that was thrifted and came from Depop. First thing that came from Depop, they're not here yet. But I did get some Uggs. I'll put some pictures on the screen. I'm not going to show her name. I ordered them like almost two weeks ago I feel like. And they have not been shipped yet. She says she's looking for a um, I don't know how long it takes to find a box, but if it, if it gets to be um, any longer, I'm just going to file a dispute and get my money back. But I really did get a good deal on those Uggs, so I'm not really trying to do that. But I got Uggs for a hundred. They were a hundred. Y'all know Uggs were on like 180. She had them up for like 130, I want to say. And I messaged her about them in August, and I was like, you know, I'm going to buy these when it gets colder outside, okay? Because... <laughs> And so when I went to go buy them, she actually lowered the price to 100 So I went ahead and got them in. So I did get some Uggs at the regular chestnut ones. I have bear paws up in the front because I have a problem with keeping shoes clean. Not keeping shoes clean, but like little spills on my shoes and stuff. So my bear paws are kind of messed up. But I'm going to keep those for like walking through Christmas lights and stuff so I don't like crease up my Uggs. But I did get a pair of Uggs this year. So the next thing that I got from Depop was actually another crew neck and this one just says New York on it and it's another green color. It's from Shein and it's a size extra small but it's one of the oversized ones so it'll fit like a, a small medium. I'm a medium and the arms are actually a little bit short on me. I'm not gonna lie they're kind of short but this crew neck was five dollars i think i paid 11 after shipping because shipping was like six dollars the only thing i don't like about it is i feel like after one like wash and dry the letters will start to peel off but that's shein material for you but i'm not gonna lie this is actually really thick this part right here is kind of thin but like all of like the outsides like the bottom of the arms and like the collar and stuff those parts are really thick but this is a really nice crew neck that I thought would be really cute for the winter time so I went ahead and grabbed this but I was looking for more crew necks anyway so the last thing that I got from Depop I was actually really excited about for some reason so y'all know I've gained so much weight in quarantine and just like I don't know how to explain it. The best way I can explain it for you is when I started, we got out of school for COVID um, my junior year in like the middle of the year. The beginning of my junior year, I was like a, a two-ish, like a two. Um, by the middle of junior year, I was like a three, four. And now I'm a size seven. American Eagle, I'm a six. And Hollister, I'm a seven. Those are the only jeans I wear. Fashion Nova is just too tight around this stomach. I found me some jeans off Depop. They are the, um, they're Hollister, they're mid-rise. They fit fine, they're super skinny. I like skinny jeans, I'm a skinny jeans gal. I could not get into that trend of the, y'all see, I did get a pair though, but they have two rips at the knee. I'm not gonna lie, when I bought them, I thought they were gonna be more distressed than what they are, but I got to thinking about it, and I think just the knee rips will be fine for like the fall and the winter time. But these are a size seven long. This is my size in Hollister. I have to get longs because I got long leg but these were $20 and free shipping so they were $21.40 after tax so don't sleep on depop because you can get stuff that's pretty much brand new for a really good price and y'all already saw these these came from the thrift store but I had to pick up a pair of leggings if you see my video where I went thrifting I'll put it up here I just got me some black leggings from the thrift store okay they fit really nicely they're a little bit big but I mean we could always grow into them because of the right I'm growing yeah so the next thing we're gonna get into in the final parts of the video is going to be my shein stuff so the first thing i'm going to show you guys is my accessories so i actually ordered this a while back i just figured i'd include it but it is a butterfly anklet i had a butter i really like the butterfly anklets okay i think they're really cute um and i had one but when i was trying to take it off it wasn't coming off so i pulled it off and of course it ripped um, so I bought me another one. It is that same. Okay, you can't really see it, but it just has white butterflies on it and it's silver. And also, ignore my nails because my nails are not done right now, but they will be done in my next video. Um, so stay tuned for my next video because I feel like y'all are going to like that one. Because y'all have not seen a week in my life yet, but y'all have been asking for it. So that's going to be a week in my life, but we're not going to talk about it right now. The next thing I got was another three-pack of ankles from Shein. So the first one that I got is this bigger... One, then this is the second anklet that it came with. 
third one is kind of looks like a necklace to me but this is the third one that it came with it's kind of like a smaller um rope kind of chain but i got a three pack of gold anklets of course they're open because i already wore them um but i just kind of re-up on anklets and since they're so cheap i'll just get them every time i get a shein order and i don't wear earrings like that the only pair of earrings i wear is like my pearls but i did decide to get a pair of studs I'm not that girl that wears expensive earrings because like I said, earrings is like the jewelry that I wear the least. They picked me up a silver pair of studs from Shein. They're really cute. My nails look so ugly. I wore these a lot too, so they're also open. Those are all the accessories that I got from Shein. And now for the clothes, which is probably like my favorite part. Everything's still in the bag because this just came on, uh, I believe like Wednesday or Thursday this came. Today's Thursday, so I think this came like a week ago. We're going to go ahead and get into it. So the first thing I got um, is a pair of mom jeans. I don't really like this style of jeans. These I thought were really cute on me. If you guys don't know, I'm putting my tall girls on. Shein has a section of like tall clothing. So like the arms will be a little bit longer. The legs will be longer. And that's where I got these jeans from. I feel like the quality is just the same as regular Shein quality. And the prices are the same as well. You're not paying more money for the jeans. I'm going to read y'all off the prices. Cause I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so these mom jeans, I got them in a size medium and these were $23, which is a little bit pricey to me at least because I'm used to shopping at Depop. But they are just, they have like gaping holes in the leg um, and the bottoms are just, you know, like the perfect fit in the waist. I like how the waist is kind of smaller than everything else. Cause yeah, the only thing I will say I don't like is the button on these jeans. It's like very loose and very cheap feeling, but when the button is buttoned, you don't really hear it. I don't think, um, but these were super cute. They're, a, they're an okay quality. Like they feel, they're not stretchy. Like how like Hollister jeans are, but they're also not real. Like how Levi's are. They just feel really thin to me. But they were super cute and i'd say they're worth 23 dollars considering that jeans brand new at other places are like 60. so i did get a pair of these jeans y'all seen in the try on they do go all the way down so my tall girls definitely shop in the shein tall section i'm five foot eight and these fit me perfectly so the next thing from shein that i got i had like an outfit idea for when i got it so this has been in my wish list since last year um but i'm finally getting around to getting it and this shirt was 15 dollars. this shirt is not worth more than 10 to me i wouldn't have paid more than 10 dollars for it but it is this dark green flannel it is cropped and it also has the strings down here so you can like cinch it around a little bit more um but it is this dark green color i can't remember if the sleeves fit me or not i don't think they did but y'all see that in the try on um, I got this in a size medium because they did say if you have a bigger chest size up and I don't have a big chest but I got long arms so I'm thinking if it's small in the chest it gotta be small in the arms so I got a medium but I could have went for a large I did not size up in this for it to be oversized I like my clothes to fit me so I did get this you know in my regular size I thought this would be really cute with my black jeans and my black Uggs but y'all will be getting a fall lookbook kind of video so be on the lookout for that so this next thing from Shein is one of my favorites that I got actually and it is a black sweater I feel like I don't I had a black sweater but I don't know where it went so I got another one and this one is one of those really distressed sweaters and it's cropped and it's off the shoulder and it's just perfect like everything is perfect the sleeves are distressed I just like it the only thing that I don't like is this joint is really off the shoulder like when I tell you like if you wear it up on one, you gotta wear it down. And if you wear it down on both shoulders, it's gonna fall off of you. That's how oversized it is. I got this sweater in a size small because they did say size down. I would have got an extra small, but they didn't have it. All they had was a small. And I really feel like I could have went down to an extra small because even though I have long arms, first of all, these sleeves are long. But second of all, when it's off the shoulder, it gives you more like arm room. So I feel like I would have been fine with the extra small, but I just, I just got what they had, which was a small. This sweater was $18, which is also a little bit pricey because I wouldn't have paid more than 15 for this because it's, it's really thin. I'm not going to lie, but I mean, that's the new trend, you know, thin, cheap shit is what's cute right now. So I can't believe this video is already over. Like this is the last thing I have to show you guys. I can't believe this video is over. I feel like I've only been here for five minutes and I've really been here for like 40, but I got a white sweater and this one is really cute. This one was $12. This one is a little bit better on the quality side. It is like a cotton material and the inside is really cute. But it is another cropped off the shoulder one and it has like a V neck which I thought it was so cute. It has like a cute little like cuff on the sleeve. Um, it's very cute with the mom jeans that I showed y'all. So y'all definitely don't sleep on Shein's little sweaters and stuff. I got this in a size small and like I said it was $12. Y'all see it in a try on. This just fits so freaking cute. Like I just love it. Like y'all please don't sleep. Okay please don't sleep. That is so crazy. This 
haul is already over so that is everything that i've got right now i will show you guys the uggs when they come they might come Hopefully they'll come before I go out of town so I can show you guys in like my little get ready with me when I get the package. I don't know. I'm literally going to keep bothering her until she ships them because uh, the post office has boxes that you can get, okay, if you can't find one. You know what I mean? But so that is all for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure you give it a thumbs up and comment down below what your favorite pieces are and also what kind of other videos you want to see from me because I have this month all planned out, but I don't have nothing planned out for November, okay? The link for everything that I got will be in the description if I can find it. Everything from Sheen and stuff will be in the description, but the stuff from Ross, I mean, you can can't really link that because Ross don't have a website. If you're new here and you made it to the end of the video, why not stick around forever? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video because we I have been I have been successful sticking to my uploading schedule so far. I upload every Sunday and Wednesday at six o'clock Eastern Standard Time because I live in North Carolina. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see y'all in the next video. Bye y'all.